I've noticed on a few rare occasions in matchmaking that my teammate throws a grenade and dies, but I'm still able to pick up that grenade from their dead body. I've finally been bored enough to look at what's happening. It's a lot simpler than I thought it was going to be. A grenade throw is kind of weird. Even though you throw the grenade, it is still in your hand for a few moments. If you kill someone in these moments, the grenade, since it's already thrown, will travel like normal, and the grenade that is still in your animation's hand will drop below the player, duplicating the grenade. If you use host time scale, you can see this a lot better. Like here, the grenade is thrown and it's still in his hand. Still in his hand, and boop, gone. Hacks! The time you can kill someone and duplicate a grenade is based on how the throw is. For a left click throw, I found the window to dupe the grenade from the start of the animation to the last moment is about 0.8 seconds before it just kinda pops out of existence. If it gets to this point, it's too late. They're gone. For the right click, it's only about 0.53. Sorry, 0.53 seconds long. Of course, this really isn't too viable. In order to dupe the grenade, either you or your teammate needs to die, or you can luck out and kill the enemy team with a nade out. But chances are this won't happen. Normally, if someone has a weapon out, the most expensive grenade will drop. If someone has a grenade in their hand, that one will drop. And it's the same case with this, as I think in-game the player still has the grenade in their hand? I don't know. Basically, the grenade they throw will be the one duplicated. You can dupe these as much as you need, and they will still work like normal. I tried to find why this weird bug happens. I searched through the model editor to check for different animations for grenades, but couldn't find any of the animations. I would think there's two for grenades, and having the grenade just kind of delete itself after the first one. I thought of this by looking at the model in game. It kind of skips a little bit as soon as the grenade disappears. I'm not for sure, so I won't say anything definite. What would I do? Probably split up this first animation into two, and it splits at the point where the grenade is thrown. This way you can delete it right after, and this should delete most of the gap. But since I don't edit models or animations, I have no idea if this would work. In conclusion, killing someone breaks the conservation of matter. Next stop, perpetual motion machine.